This little fluidine engine is made from acrylic to a design from the book Liquid Piston Stirling Engines by C.D. West. This is the displacer section with the cold column here on the right and the hot column on the left. The column right over here on the left hand side is the tuning column which according to West is much shorter than it should be to resonate with the displacer. The heat source is a 33 ohm 5 watt resistor which is driven from 15 volt power pack so the power input is about 6.8 watts. The working fluid is water with a little ink in it to make it more, uh, more visible. West says that evaporation is important in this engine. If the water is replaced with oil, the engine will not run. He also says that adding sugar to the water makes it run better because it increases the viscosity and improves the flow pattern. I've not tried this yet. In a bigger engine, the varying head in the tuning column here can be used to drive a pump or perform some other useful work. Morris Dovey in the United States is working on a full-sized solar-powered pump for use in third world countries, a very worthwhile project.